Hi guys, so in today's video I thought I would film a bonding video for you guys. So in today's video I'm going to be bonding Tozy and Florence in with my trio. So um, yes, we've had one of my boys die so we're moving, just I'm moving the guinea pigs around at the moment. So basically today I'm going to be making a group of five and they'll be living in a three by six. So let's pop the pigs in and do an introduction. So my typical bonding method is um so typically i will go and do neutral territory always so this cage none of these specific guinea pigs have ever lived in but it has been disinfected it's got hay piles there's nothing they can fight over but if it's nice weather like slash for example spring and summer they will be outside for a bonding So as you guys can go see, all five pigs are currently in the bonding pen. So Tozy does also have one eye. She has her final checkup for that, but the vet did clear her for the bonding. So we currently have Albert over there, who's our little boy. Tozy here. Florence back there. Um, Phoebe here. And then Phoebe's mum, Sesame, who's just over there. So, so far, like introductions, I never had really any concerns over this intro because it's quite a chilled group of pigs to do an intro with to be honest it's not it was never really something i had doubts or concerns about really we have a nice chill group of piggies the next bonding i will have to do is between the group that lived in this cage which was a group of six they will then be going in with my group of nine because archie passed away so that's another introduction video that'll be up but as you guys can see there isn't even really any dominance behaviors they are kind of keeping to who they lived with before which is normal so i'm going to give them some veg in a minute just to see if i can kind of provoke some sharing maybe behaviors and just see how they share and how things go in terms of that but you don't really want to give them anything they can fight over but yeah no sesame and phoebe and um tozy have all lived together before and tozy was the alpha female within that but Phoebe was very, very young at that point. But these two girls I've never met so far. Yeah, it's just a very nice, chill group of pigs ready to do an introduction with, to be honest. So I just thought as well, I've notes, I'm just going to note some behaviours I'm currently seeing. So um, Florence there, who's the teddy female, she is doing some marking where she's dragging her bum down. But she has just challenged Phoebe, who's the alpha female, who was the alpha female for the trio. So, yeah. Just a bit of jabbing really, which is all just general dominance behaviours. It's what I want to see. I'd rather them do it whilst I'm here than them do it overnight or... But yeah, no, we also won't be adding any toys or anything that they can argue over for at least 24 hours. So Tozy's just peed in her face. That's what that back off was because she's just got a bit of pee in her face. But again, it's just a really nice, chilled, easy introduction. For some reason she seems to be protecting Tozy, but she is coming out as the alpha female within this but that is not aggressive that is just a lot of people in my personal opinion would separate too early or would potentially separate for that whereas that's not aggressive that is just a bit of dominance and that's just a bit of pushing and shoving which you should expect to see but i've got um stuff on hand to diffuse the situation and to split up if it does turn into a fight but albert there i just sorted that out but um you know albert is a new to boy so their kind of job is to kind of keep the girls in check and to maintain peace within the group but it's always more difficult doing adult introductions because they have their own personalities etc
So all this behaviour you'll see now and the vocalisations, that's called teeth chattering. So that is an aggressive vocal in a sense, but unless blood is drawn, I won't separate because they have to do this in a sense. So this is why it's really important that you keep quite a close eye on them whilst you're doing this introduction. I don't know if you guys can go see, the actual issue for some reason seems between, between Sesame and Albert. Now Sesame and Albert have lived together for 18 months, so I don't know where this issue is slightly coming from. It's not an aggressive issue, it's more a dominance issue. But everyone else doesn't really... Tozy's surprising, actually Tozy's not getting into the arguments, but yeah. See that there I wouldn't separate for because that there was a bit of a lunge, a bit of a that there wasn't an act of active aggression, even though it was aggression, I personally wouldn't separate for that. So just give them some um Possibly. Hi guys, so these guys have now all been together for 24 hours now, which is crazy, but so far so good, um, everything seems to have calmed down quite drastically, so um, yeah, so the girls seem to have accepted that they are together, Albert is still being a little bit dominant, but um, late last night, oh, sorry, this morning I decided to add some houses and some litter trays, as you guys can see, everything is multi-entrance, because at the moment, even though they are settled with each other, you don't want to risk um, any aggression or any or somebody getting trapped over a house or just uh, so. I don't know everything at least has more than one entrance, an exit point, just so they can't trap each other. But um, yeah, no, I'm really proud of how everyone's done. To be honest, quite an, it's probably the most dramatic bond I've ever done, but I don't think it's been the hardest. Um, so the next bond will be, so basically I have my four boys and we lost one of them yesterday so hence I merged those two girls in with these three because Tozy had to get her eye removed and so she then had to separate, separate from her group and then yeah so that then made me have the space for a group of five with this group but then my group of six is going to be getting bonded with my group of nine to make a group of fifteen so that's going to be a really interesting bond for me to do but yeah so i'd like to say these guys are bonded and yeah thank you guys for watching and i think the next video i will be uploading as a haul and then after that it will be a bonding video but yeah like as you guys can see there it's not aggressive it's more just general dominance which they have to do like all that is just a bit of pushing and shoving around like those two guys over there are having a bit of an argument they've lived together for, ye for over a year now and it's just not like the girls like they've just got sorted out but in general they've chilled out quite a lot